not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. I was early, so take? your baby's probably just early too. How you doing, Beck? Okay, I'm okay. How did you guys make Museum's out? Museum's a bust. All glass walls shattered. It'd be impossible. And it was picked over pretty good. Lots of folks probably been there before us. The walker in there almost got us. Lucky Mike was there. Clem's the one who finished it off. Looks like you also found some water. We sure did. Good, good. We save all of that for Rebecca. Anybody else gets a thirst, you can go to the river. Is that where you've just been? Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby. Back at Carver's. In the office. He stayed behind to stop the people chasing us. He died to keep us safe. Jesus. Of course. Of course he did. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's going to be a girl. Oh, yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a boy. Didn't you see a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Didn't you say you thought it was going to be a oh, girl shit. at the start? I got this. Like episode two or whatever it was. I'm worried that we ain't seen Jane in a while. Go check on her, would you? Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Let's go see how Bonnie's in first. What are you thinking about? I'm worried about Rebecca. Having a baby can be rough enough on a woman, even in a nice, clean hospital. Does she even have a shot out here? No idea. That walk seemed longer to you on the way back. No, but thanks for carrying the water. I didn't realize how tired I was until I put it down. I need to rest up a bit. Seems like folks appreciated it, though. That's good. Maybe I'll come around after all. Yep. Yeah. You'll be fine. I hope. Hey, Sarah. <laughs> the climbs teleport. Like started walking through and then just teleported back and started walking through again. Jane Clementine, up here. Hi. Oh, hey. Museum was a bust, huh? Nope. We found water. A lot of it. Well, that's something, at least. Check this out. A skate still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. I've been trying to get it open, but it's locked pretty tight. That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. 
You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Like what? A bin? A poster? I doubt we can move the cannon. That's not gonna help. I don't think we can use this either, but we may as well have a look. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't Who's make that? it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. It's Ben. <laughs> and who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around. Should we run for it? Normally I would, but it's too much That's of a risk. Ben with glasses. We can't lead him to the others. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. How did he not hear that? What's he doing? Hey. I just want to talk to you. Do you understand me? Yes. I am Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone, especially маленькая девочка, little girl. Okay, I'm leaving. I'll leave you alone. Okay. I am not going. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to we you. We just need to make sure you're not a threat. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. If that medicine's for your sister, why are you hiding it in the garbage? I, uh, I need to keep it, I need to keep it safe. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you, you take my sister's medicine? You are worried. You hey, need we've it. got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we need People that stuff. are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Clementine, yes, you must believe... We don't believe, believe a fucking word about your sick sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough. You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, bullshit. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. Last minute that Clem got kidnapped. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? We should go get everyone else. Yeah.
Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place open. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Oh, let's look. Hey, look. About time someone came to check on us. Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation? Thanks, there? Jack. I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop, and a stranger showed up. What? Shit. This is the last thing we need right now. What happened? Jane took his gun and scared him off. Well, I, uh, I'm glad you're okay. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop open. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm still not sure what to think about her. She's strong, and she's been helping us, but she's cold. Well, Maybe. that's when our time. Nobody's that cold. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to break. Give her a jacket. They'll keep what her warm. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. Yeah, he always tries to do the right thing. But he's not the same anymore. I'm glad you see it too. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. You may have noticed a little jump in the scene with Jane and Arvo. It's because the stream, for me anyway, it stopped and it just said YouTube. Like, the stream has stopped for some reason and I refreshed the page and it's still saying that. So I stopped the streaming and I started again. So.